Okay, so Carl hate. This is so sad to say, but Carl getting hate over nonsense. Things are very common over the internet. Carl can literally receive hate just by being on Mr. Beast of videos, saying that he's cringe and he ruined Mr. Beast. And he also got hate for being a friends with Dream, saying that he just uses Dream and Mr. Beast clout, especially now that he's streaming on Twitch. But this past few days or weeks, the hate on Carl seems to take turn, especially now that he's labeled as racist and transphobic. And the reason why is because Ice Poseidon, a YouTuber and a streamer who is actually known for having a dark and edgy humor, has been called out for being a racist. And also Pokimane who is transphobic and basically said the n-word. So confusion can now enter the chat because why out of all people Carl suddenly become associated on this drama? Well the reason is he is once a fan of Ice Poseidon. There's even a picture of them together and for Pokimane I mean we can all see their interactions during streams or even on Twitter. Well you may have already seen that Carl actually addresses this issue on his live stream and quick to apologize about the situation. And he actually also mentioned that he, he didn't even support Ice Poseidon's racism takes or jokes, that he is just a fan of Twitch because he wanted to become a streamer one day. And it's so sad and frustrating to see at the same time that Carl actually pointed out and even the thread said that it happened on the past. But people are acting as if like people can change, mature, and grow up. And even on Pokimane because obviously I can speak for Ice Poseidon because he's still on the edgy side of the internet. But for Pokimane, I haven't really watched her but she seems to change. I mean, she might have a very problematic past but she might have matured and grow. And once again, going back to Carl, it's so sad that he's literally the one getting attacked just because he was once a fan of a problematic content creator. Like, come on! Cancel the actual person who is racist, not the person who was once a fan and actually already apologizes on everything, saying that he actually doesn't even condemn their actions. But I mean, oh well, that's Twitter right there. The place where people seems to can't move forward because they are stuck on either canceling someone on what they did in the past or canceling someone just for random stuff. And their life value seems to be stuck by believing that people can be matured and learn from their mistakes. Like I swear, people on Twitter have this mentality that if you're a bad person, you're a bad person for life. Like you're done. Well, that's all my rants for today. Bye!